Hi guys, how are you? Hi, good, good, good thank you. I'm good, I'm good. The film is incredible, just to oh, start. Really, I just want to say you've so all much. done an amazing job. You've oh. absolutely smashed it. But I know that a few of you didn't actually know each other when you first came together mm. in the cast. Actually, a lot of you didn't. The majority didn't of the class yeah. didn't know I anyone. Didn't know How did you guys bond at first? Did you play any bonding games or you know anything at is, all? Yeah? We're all just good spirits. Yeah. Mm. When good spirits come together in a room, it just happens naturally, man. Yeah. yeah. I get you. I mean, I'll say, to be honest, I think most of the bonding happened at lunch. We were all kind of stuck. Not stuck. We were in this <laughs> room. <laughs> we were stuck in this room. <laughs> No, we were in this room and there was just like loads of gym equipment and so we'd really just bounce yeah. about on the gym, gym equipment. equipment. <laughs> 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 So you just bounce about in the gym equipment. Rap and have battles. Fun. Doing yeah, some yeah. squats. And yeah, no, doing literally, literally, we would just do, uh, get out of absolute messing foolishness around. in oh, this that, room. Well, that's a good way to yeah. start bonding. <laughs> yeah. Might have to take that as a little tip, eh, in the future. <laughs> Carl, I just want to start with you yeah. because you was actually quite sceptical at first about the role and yeah. if you felt like it was something you felt comfortable doing. But yeah. as you read the script, you realised this is amazing and you was willing to go forward with it. Yeah. What was it about the character that convinced you that you was able to actually perform this role to the fullest? Well, what I liked about Leah is that she's the moral compass, well, one of the moral compasses yeah. of the film. She's trying to lead um, Timmy down like a good path. So I really liked that about her because she's part of the message that we're trying to put across. Um, but I really enjoyed playing her because it was like I had to strip back a lot of myself to play a younger person, you know, more insecure and all of that and just be, I don't know, like just more impressionable, mm -hmm. I guess, like less having that kind of front where I'm like, I'm a woman, more like, yeah. you know, kind of... Yeah, I really enjoyed playing her. Yeah. Was it like you had to kind of result to your younger self or kind of get into character? When you was trying to mm -hmm. perform and um, perfect your character, what, yeah. how did you um, get into, into character? Yeah. What was best for you? What was your technique? I think my technique was just thinking about me when I was younger, yeah. back in school, like how I was, you know, you just be in school and there's like boys around and you're kind of like, oh, like, just, you know, just, just, you're not like comfortable Please. in your skin yet, do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, she's quite like, Although she is confident, but it's in the confidence where it's like, at the same time, she's like still quite sweet and like, you know, timid in a way. Kadeem, you did amazing. Oh, you had you. me cracking up, had me crying <laughs> tears. We loved it, absolutely loved it. How do you, um, how important do you think it is to have a social media presence? Because you've got quite a strong social media presence online. Um, do you feel like it's necessary in acting? Or I feel like, feel like it like is it's... necessary because, first of all, I feel mm. like people underestimate the power of social media. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And I just, I just, I took that route because I wanted to build a base for myself. You know what I'm saying? And I wanted to create some opportunities for myself, which it did, and I'm thankful. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And you, Rowan, incredible once again, all Thank three you. of you, you Thank did you. absolutely well. <laughs> and I just want to say, you actually have um, a strong, um, strong experience in theatre as well. Yeah. So how yeah. different is it uh, between theatre and filmmaking for you? What do you prefer as well? Um, I've always wanted to end up in film and TV. That's always kind of been the direction that I wanted mm -hmm. to go in. But I think the, the subtleties of film and being behind a camera or in front of a camera are, are a lot harder than, you know, kind of being able to grow and make yourself bigger on stage. So I find for me that one of the challenges was just kind of trying to bring it all down to a, a realistic level and mm -hmm. nothing too over the top so that it felt like I was out of place. Mm -hmm. So that's what, yeah, I think that's one no, of the I completely understand because it must be quite different because theatre is more exaggerated, yeah, whereas yeah. film, you're, going, you're trying to act natural and act in like theater, a normal Yeah, you're acting for the act. people in the back row, whereas right. for a camera, you've got it right there. So it must yeah. have been a bit tough there at times, I guess. It was tough, but I think it was definitely worth the challenge and working with these guys were always the most helpful. So yeah. And I just want to know you guys' favourite part about your characters, your favourite scene. If you had to say one scene that you would say is the best of the best, I literally killed that scene and that was my <laughs> favourite part of the whole film and that's number one. What would it be? I, enjoy, I can't lie, I enjoyed the party scene. Yeah, Did you? Yeah, yeah, yeah you killed that, that one. Yeah. That scene. was so funny. <laughs> you were like... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, yeah. that was too oh. funny. Um, I don't know, you know, before I was going to say the bus scene, but if you're saying like where we actually feel like we did it, the bits, I say the party scene as well, just because that's where Dwayne's personality comes out a bit yeah. more. He's got his hair done, he's feeling himself, he's about girls, he wants right. to try and dance with Leah, mm -hmm. the whole thing. Yeah, say that part, yeah, that scene as For well. For me, I feel it's the scene where she's like, how many singers, you know, that come out of Peckham? I feel like that scene is just really nice just mm. to see that romance, you know, and growth. Really powerful, that. Mm. I love that scene. Thank you guys so much. Thank You've you. Been thank so, you. so, so great. And the film was once again so good. So thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.